Hey, good morning. What's up, guys? Welcome to the channel. Thanks for tuning in. This is John's Moto Garage. I'm John, and this is where we buy and sell motorcycles. Today, I'm going to do a quick walk around and cold start on this 2014 Victory Hammer 8-Ball. If you haven't already checked them out, I've got a few other videos posted. Uh, one of me actually picking up this bike. I also have a ride video where I take you on board so you can get a more comprehensive, in-depth idea of my uh, overall impression of the bike and the riding experience. And I also go into detail what I paid for the bike, how much I think it's worth, all that good stuff. The idea with the channel is I buy and sell bikes, so I plan to buy at least one a week and try to sell like 16 a week if we can do that. I might be setting my goals a little bit high, but hopefully we can pull it off. But anyway, you guys, without further preamble, let's go ahead and get started. Let's jump into this. So again, this is a 2014 Victory Hammer 8-Ball. This comes standard with the 106 cubic inch engine that comes out to about 1731 cc. Super aggressive, four-stroke V-twin engine. This thing's a beast. They call it the Bad Boy Cruiser. Definitely a muscle cruiser to be reckoned with. This has aftermarket 2 into one Cobra exhaust. Very good choice by my estimations. I'm not a big fan of the stock exhaust on these bikes. You've got the forward controls, foot pegs, panning over to the front. You've got inverted front forks. Definitely gives it more of a sporty handling. Able to maneuver through traffic with ease. You've got the uh, front wheel alloy wrapped in 130-70-18 front tire. It's a beautiful thing. 300 millimeter floating rotors, disc brakes. This has the belt drive rolling over here to the back. Look at the girth of that fatty back tire. This thing's a 250 4018 rear tire comes standard on these bikes. So if you're looking for that wow factor, getting compliments, turning heads, this one definitely fits the bill. As you can see, totally blacked out dragster here front to end. You got the sporty drag bar style handlebars. Custom looking tank melds right into the seat. The low profile integrated rear light comes with that rear seat cowl. Pops on and off easily as well. So if you want to throw a friend on the back, you can do so. They probably won't be too comfortable but it is possible. Overall, tremendous value on this bike. Check out my other videos, we'll go into that as far as what I paid for it, all that good stuff. Notice you got the high cut rear fender, shows off that fatty rear tire. That's unique to the Victory Hammer. You're not gonna get that with the Vegas 8 ball or any of those. This thing puts out, I think, 110, 110 feet pound, foot pounds of torque. So she's a beast. No problem at all. You got that instant throttle response, outstanding power. Complete beast of a motorcycle for sure, for sure. Again, totally blacked out front to rear. Six speed transmission, got the overdrive. I think I mentioned that removable rear passenger cowl. With those inverted forks, that helps to enhance the, uh, just the handling, makes for a smooth ride, similar to what you got on your sport bikes. All in all, my friends, Pretty dope motorcycle, if that's what you're looking for. Like I said, more of a custom look. You don't see a ton of these out there. So to your lay person, this looks like a custom chopper cruiser. I always get compliments on this one. All right, let's go ahead and do a cold start. See how she sounds with the aftermarket Cobra exhaust. See how the tachometer works. Just cruising. All 
All right, you guys, hopefully the audio quality is not horrible with the exhaust running. But again, we got the Cobra, two into one exhaust. This is aftermarket. Still has the baffles in, so it's not overly obnoxious, but definitely louder than stock. And they'll hear you coming. Nice deep throaty sound. How oh, my motorcycle should sound, am I right? All in all, nice, clean, slick looking bike. We'll pan around here to the front. Nice aggressive stance. Pretty slick motorcycle here. So again, 2014 Victory Hammer 8 Ball, 106 cubic inch, Torque Monster. So all in all sounds pretty good. Nice custom looking bike if that's what you're digging, if that's what you're looking for. This is definitely a good, good option. And like I said, phenomenal value. A lot of bang for your buck with this bike. So as always, if you're digging the content, be sure to smash the like button, subscribe, Leave a comment below. Let me know if you have any questions, if there's anything else you'd like me to go over. Yeah, maybe you're in the market for this bike, or maybe you want to get into buying and selling yourself. So hit me up. Don't be shy, you guys. As always, I appreciate the support. Gracias for tuning in. Enjoy the rest of the day, the rest of the week. And we'll hit you up the next time. Hasta luego. Like a bird on a tree